So now we're back. Once again, if you like this kind of content, let us know. Hit that subscribe button and thumbs up. It always helps the channel. Let me show you where we're at right now. So what we've done so far, like we said, is we filled in the, the plates like I showed you last time. But this time, we also welded those brackets in for the bolts. hardware we have new shackle brackets new pieces there we also have new new brakes in, to install and then we come up here and we've got the third axle that wasn't in here before and we've got that hooked up on new hardware so as we continue to go around here we still have the front piece to put in we haven't done that yet as you can see it's still open so we still got some work to do there and we still have to put the, the safety chains in uh, over here, we've welded, we've uh, filled in some of that red box. On, on the other side, we've uh, also got the new shackle bolts, the new, new axles and stuff. We've got new, new brakes. gotta get ready to put this new one in so we gotta get that one off right that piece right there got new shackle brackets and all just trying to think when i spin this it's going to lock in and hold it No, oh, that actually. I mean, that's not a. Hell, yeah, it's not making noise. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. How do we get so easy, man? That's right. Wow, look at this back here. I know. Did you see this? No, no. How worn that How is. How wore out it is, and then back in his back. How wore that is. Oh wow. Be careful buying an old trailer. All these things are things you're gonna have to make sure you're ready to deal with. If it looks tired, it probably is. <laughs> yeah, but if you've got the tools and the time to repair it, it might be worth it. You know, the new ones are not inexpensive. It's, it's wore out quite a bit. We'll replace that with a good bushing. This one's not too bad, you see it? Just to get it out of here. Uh, new bolts and stuff in there. So, hopefully, we'll get all this back together. And uh, we should be done fairly soon. So, if you have any questions on how we're doing it or something, uh, just leave a comment below. Well, you know, once again, just go ahead and get you some tools, get you a project, and get to work. See you on the next video. Thank <laughs> you.